so fly, check my profile. Who you know make waves in a low tide? Deep bow choke, that she both eyes. Little brown leg in my liver. Pretty brown thing in my bed. Morning, pioneers. Or afternoon. Um, I'm home now after my long trip that I had or vacation. But this morning, I'm starting my day off. It was good, but I'm ran into some issues. And it starts off with my vehicle. So yesterday I came home and I realized that, hey, my mother's Mercedes Benz is outside and it's right behind my car. And she's still, being that she's still in New York, my car would be pretty much blocked off, right? So this morning I saw that my brother took out his vehicle and took it to his apartment. And I realized maybe it'd work out being that I now have enough space. And I'm not sure if you can see behind me to take my car out by putting it on drive and in reverse and just driving out but then I ran into an issue with my car not starting I don't know how this happens but every time I go on vacation for a longer period of time of more than a week or so my car just will not power on anymore and I mean if you were to check the keys I can press anything and everything and it'd go orange I'm not sure if you can see the LED orange or red that means that it's not even, it's not getting power to the actual vehicle, nor can I open a vehicle or do anything to it. So right now there's gonna be a power jumpstart service coming to me and that comes free with the Acura um, brand or make. I think it's an Acura certified, I'm not sure. Um, and I'm waiting for that to come so that I can actually get my car working because I need to handle some things and I also wanna get out the house. But when that comes, you guys will definitely be seeing what's going on, how to jumpstart a vehicle, or how Acura actually services their vehicles when it's in need. I got a call from Acura Rescue, and he should be outside. I caught a call from him, saying that he's a minute away. I'm walking out right now. I don't know if I'm going to videotape the entire thing, being that I don't know if he'd feel comfortable with it. Is it the same guy from last time? No, it isn't. And yeah, uh, hopefully this time around, my car can power on correctly without it happening again. And I know I need to take it in because Acura told me it may be an electrical issue. So after this, I'm gonna see how that goes and if it powers on and if everything's okay and then I'm going to set up my appointment the next time. It doesn't power, it doesn't power on. It's actually, it's entirely dead. Okay. And this happens when I go like on vacation. So the car like completely dies on me. The keys don't work. It doesn't unlock, it doesn't lock. Yeah. Right here. Did it just turn on? No. Oh. Okay. Okay, so now we're gonna try powering it on. Or power starting it, then powering it on. Okay. Let's start up. Nope. Okay. Hit the button again. Double. I have to double tap it. Yeah. So everything's off, right? Yep. Everything's off. Would you like to get in? Yeah, okay. Yeah, so yeah, as I was saying, I know that I need to take it in for um, to actually get it checked up because the electronics is not working. Like the auto steering does not work at all even afterwards. But I think they may need to give me another vehicle in the time that I keep it there as the girl that I was speaking to. No, I purchased it. It's financed. Um, but... <sighs> Yeah, I don't know what's going on. It's super weird. It's getting to the point where it's bothersome. Do you want me to try it again? Okay. So I'm gonna try it again. See how this goes. It's completely dead. It usually takes a while. Okay, double tapped it. Perfect. So I'm trying to figure out when I'm going to set up this appointment and get it in there. It's getting annoying to this point, but um, yeah. 
car super clean, by the way. Just a few papers here. Again? Not again. Okay. Right. Double tap it. Yep, for sure. To activate the power steering, it'd be right here. This automatically just does not allow the car to get close to any other vehicle in front of it, and neither of those are working. Neither is cruise control. So, yeah. I don't want to tow it because I don't know how they treat my vehicle anyway there, so that's why I just want to set up the appointment and drive my car. Um, to the actual dealership. The last time he had to jump start it with his own car, but it took like five minutes of him pushing on the gas. I don't know what's up with that girl. And this is why I'm definitely grabbing another car this year. Not this year, but 2017. I'm buying another car. For sure, for sure. Um, don't know what's going on. It shouldn't be happening. It's a brand new car. I purchased it in like March or February. No, it, it was March. Brand new. And I don't know. And I don't know why this is happening. I was gone for a month and I guess the battery drained. That's what happened. I mean, it's 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 a brand new car, so I wouldn't understand how or why that would happen with it sitting in my driveway. Um, So I really, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to tell you guys. They don't even know what to do. And I don't think taking it in would fix it either. Because they told me that taking it in would only fix the electronic issues that I'm having. Which is, again is the power steering. Or the auto steering. Where it turns by itself. Or it drives by itself. And then the stay away from other vehicles. The, the um, collision prevention feature. And that also doesn't work. So I'm trying to figure out when I can do that. Right, try, now. try now. Try again. Nope. Nope. Almost messed up the car. Shut her down. Shut her down. Well, that shut down my car. I didn't even do anything. That might have just taken every juice out of it. So now he's hitting the gas on his car. He hooked this car up. Right, try it now. Try now. It's not gonna happen. Cause it needs to. It's gonna need to. What's happening is, it's not. It didn't work again. I tried accessory mode. Didn't work. What's gonna need to happen? He's gonna do that. He's gonna need to do that for a while because the battery. I think what's happening is that the battery is just drained. Yeah, it's drained completely. So I think we may need to hit it for a while. I don't know what's going Actually, on. You know what? Just I want to see what comes up when you hit it. When I hit it, yeah. everything comes up, but I'll try. Everything comes on, and then it just, it turns on, but the car didn't turn on. So the electronics turns on, the car doesn't, the vehicle doesn't power on. Perfect, there we go. 2,000 miles? Yeah, I'm telling you. It makes her not look as pretty when she doesn't work. I think there's awesome cars, I'll tell you that. I don't think there's anything wrong with the car, I think there's something wrong with the car. So this means that if I was to go anywhere right now, I couldn't shut off the vehicle and I had to leave it there. I want to get some food, I can shut it off. If I wanted to go to the grocery store, I couldn't shut it off. Look who's here, my little niece. She unexpectedly came to see me. It's been like two and a half months since the last, it's been a while, very long time. It's been, no, it's been longer than a month for sure. It's, it's been like two and a half months since I've seen her. And I'm so happy to see her. I had to move my car now, somehow. Oh, my niece has to go now. Say bye. Say bye. Yeah, she has to go now. So I'm going to put her in her car. Um, as you can see, I took my car out from that spot. It was a bit difficult being that my mother's car is right behind me. And that um, she didn't move her car. And she's in New York right now, so she didn't leave her keys either. So I had to get on our yard and actually maneuver my way to getting out. Because I had to buy some groceries and stuff like that. So yeah, so she has to go now. So I'm gonna put in the car now. I actually show you guys. This is her 
father's car. Christian, put the put the radio down. When are you gonna see me again? When are you gonna see me again, huh? When 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 did she come back? I don't know. Don't talk to to be on my vlog like that. When I feel like I'm back here. Don't talk to me on my vlog like that. <laughs> don't talk to me on my vlog like that. Where'd I put this? Over here. And the yeah. Baby, you good and comfortable? Nice and comfortable? You straight? You good? Ah. I was watching the get down all day today. Catalina, <laughs> how'd you like it? It was good. It wasn't good. It was awesome. It was good as it fuck. Was, it was, it was, it was amazing. I know it's amazing. You, you, you fell in love with the story. Yeah. Christian, wouldn't you trade, wouldn't you trade being in your position, being who we are today to be that kid? Ah. Zeke? You know, is that true or no? Huh? I would trade everything about my life to be him and, and have my link. My link. My link. Oh. Bye, Catalina. Catalina, be smart. Take care. And keep talking a lot. Okay? Keep talking a lot. Bye. Give my kiss. Bye bye. Take care. Okay? Drive it safely, Christian. So as you heard, he said he loved to get down. That's one other that's another subject I need to talk about in this vlog is if you have not watched the get down, I'm gonna need you all. All of you to take the time to watch the get down. It's on Netflix. It's a story about a it's a story about the start of hip hop in Bronx, New York. And you'll fall in love with it. I'll trade my life to be Zeke. And I'll find my lane. Okay, so um, right now I'm on my way to pick up my brother. I just picked up a family friend of ours. So um, I'm picking him up. And I'm, I was supposed to be early. I think I might be early. I think I might be on time. The reason why I care so much is because he's always on time when picking me up. So I'm definitely trying to return the favor. Or the favor, excuse me. And, um, and yeah, I'm almost there right now. And I'm going to show you guys... I'm picking up him and his girlfriend, and they just got back from Dominican Republic as well because everyone went, the entire family did. So yeah, I'm gonna stop vlogging before the police stops me because I know there's always cops right around the airport. So I'm gonna shut this off and I'll see you guys soon. Okay, so I just talked to my brother. He said he's here right now. I'm going, they should be walking out pretty soon. But um, yeah, I'm gonna walk in and see if they're coming. Yo, what's up, John? John, what's up, Hannah? This is Hannah. This is my brother's girlfriend. This is Jonathan, my 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 oldest brother, and I just picked them up. Um, you know they, they needed they needed me to pick them up in a nice car, so I was like, all right, I got you. I can do that. That's no problem. Let me let me open up the back the, the back for you guys. All right, the trunk. Give me a second. Oh, uh, where's that? Right here. And I'll help him. How was the? No problem. How was the flight, guys? It was great. How was Dominican Republic? Amazing. Your first, it was your first time there, right, Hannah? Mm -hmm. And you tanned, you said you tanned, tanned for like the very first time or one of the very, very first time ever. Are you serious? Yeah. This is your first time tanning? First time tanning. And what did I tell you? What did I tell you? You told me I would tan. I, would I told you you would tan in the Caribbean sun. That's right, right? Mm -hmm. And she's she tanned. She tanned. So if you guys need to come somewhere, you gotta holler at me <laughs> and, I, and I'll take you to Dominican Republic. But you know what I'm saying? I'll hook you up. Yeah, now I gotta drive them home. We're gonna drive them to the house. After I'm going to my house, and I'm gonna see what I'm doing afterwards. But um, yes. And then so now, so now they're, they're so now it's the first time uh, meet. It's their first time meeting the family friends of ours. This is Silvia. Um, and then and then Silvia, and then Hannah. This is Hannah. Hi, Hannah. Hello. Hannah. That's Welcome. that's my brother's girlfriend, and that's Jonathan. Hey, Jonathan, Silvia. And then and then this is her. Wow, this. Um, yeah, her daughter. Hi. Her daughter, this is <laughs> Hannah. And Iberia. then my oldest, my oldest brother, Jonathan. It's Iberia. Iberia. Exactly. Yep. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop you guys off. I'm gonna contact you guys later because I shouldn't be vlogging and driving. 
How's it going, Pioneers? I don't think that I ended last night's vlog. Um, so I'm going to be ending it now and starting the following day's vlog, which is today. Um, this morning, I just did some yard work, which is very, it's like, it's like unheard of with me. Um, and yeah, today you guys will definitely see what's going on with my day today and what I'm going to be doing, what I have planned. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Much prosperity, you guys. I don't know what I do without you. I just know that this isn't like you. I remember the smiles and the laughter. What the hell happened? When I'm every day and I